So this is Alita, and she is a paraplegic kitten. And how old are you? You're like getting close to four months now. And I'm gonna do a urine expression on her. I'm gonna express her bladder. And how I do it with her, um, they're all very individual, the ones I have, I do them all differently. But with her, I take a little, um, these are Viva, so they're really soft. And I fold them up into little squares. And it's easiest, I think, for a kitten her size and how wiggly they are, I think it's easiest to hold, try to get them, their feet, on the floor between your legs. You kind of can hold them a little bit. She's very wiggly, so this is what does happen with kittens. And I put the little um, paper towels under her, her um, little area back here and right under her butt, and then I find the bladder, which is, I don't know if you can tell, but it's underneath the colon and straight down. It feels like a little egg or a little water balloon. And yes, she's real wiggly. That's okay, you just can't give up. You have to keep holding her. You kind of have a hold of them right here. I don't know if you can see, that's helpful. You gotta hold them right there above their, their hips. And then take the little paper towel and then with my thumb, I try to find the, the egg. So it's thumb and fingers. And I find the egg. <laughs> and she doesn't like it, <laughs> but that's okay. You have to be the one in control. It's not hurting her. I'm not hurting her at all. So I find the little egg and then I, I squeeze very gently and then the pee, the urine comes out. Okay, so if you see where my hands are, they're very low. So on a cat, under the spine is the colon. And she's biting me. <laughs> it's okay. But below the colon, low, is where the bladder resides. Right under here, right there. And if you can find that egg and gently squeeze it, then you're gonna get the pee. So give it a try and hopefully it will work. Mm -hmm.